is this? What are you guys doing? This is how far it can go. Are you kidding me? All right, so today we're obviously gonna be doing something a little different. What's this? Big black thing right there. We see this beautiful black thing that I'm clearly curious about. Well, go ahead. You can pull off the sheet and see what it is. Mm -hmm. Oh my! What is this? What the heck is this? What is this? What are you guys doing? Oh, it's an old phone. It's a payphone. So do you know what this is? A phone. A very, very, very old telephone. But how do you text? It's like one that you have to pay for. It's See. like on the streets and then you can pay for it with like quarters. I've seen one at my mom's, near my mom's store. I'm like, I don't see many people use these anymore. I see them sort of like in, so sometimes in big cities, and I also seen it in lots of movies. So this is a payphone. A payphone? What's a payphone? You have to pay to use it? Did your parents have this when they were kids? So have you ever used a payphone before? No. No, but I've seen someone use it before. I never used one of these, but I've seen them a lot. Now, once in my life, this has been around for centuries. These are really old, and you have to push actual buttons. How do people take this around with them to take take, to, to, like, to take Snapchats and stuff? Or does it like, just stay one in one place? And like every time you have to use it, you have to go back to that place. I can imagine that this money goes into that slot, and then it calls, but it seems very complex. It's very old. Well, I guess it will be around my grandma's time. Oh, my dad's. I know it's in one of those timelines, so maybe in like in the 70s or 60s. So how do you think you'd make a call with this? How do you like start it? Push hashtag? My mom never taught me how to use one of these. How do I use it? I'm scared if they're actually going to pick up. This is how far it can go. Are you kidding me? Calling card calls. Wait for tone and dial card number. Press these buttons. But I need money! I found this. What is this for? It says instructions here. Stop, listen for tone, and then just, what? I don't know how it works this, and I don't know who I should call. Oh, now I know how you call people is you just can't just pick up the phone. You have to, you have to put them in first before you want to call somebody. Very scared. Where do I put the coin in? Oh, I see it right up there. And then now what do I do? Um, how do I press the call? Hello? That's my mom's number. Doesn't really work. You put it inside of here, then it seems like you push this knob. It pushes the coin down and then goes inside. And then you could dial. Right, so you put in the co quarter. If the quarter doesn't work, use the coin release. Then you put in the number and just wait for them to answer. If they do answer or not, then I don't know what happens. No, look. You can't text on it. This phone, you can only call. You can't do apps, you can't do texting, you can't do anything but call. But on cell phones, you can do everything. I could imagine using this if all your electricity goes out, like all your phones don't work and iPads and that, you have this baby to call your parents to pick you up. So there's a phone slot for you to put your money. You actually didn't use the right one. You, it actually is the one on top. What? You'd have to pay money just to make a single call and you needed to put in more money if it was a long distance call. What do you think about that? A what? Excuse me. You have to pay more money to just call someone? I guess people in the back days had to keep money in their pockets all the time. You have to go to your car and stuff a bunch of quarters in your pocket and then just put a bunch of and then touch your numbers and then and then and then you don't even get anything sometimes. If you wanted to call someone's phone, you need to know their number. So do you think you'd be able to remember all of the phone numbers of all the people you needed to call? No, I usually forget them. Maybe. I forget really fast. No. I only know my mom and dad's number. Maybe not. I probably will have to write on my hand. I know almost zero of my family members' numbers. People's phone numbers, like I remember my mom, but I don't remember my dad, sadly. Burn!
you would go to the contact area and you'll find your mother's um, you find your mother's um, phone number. What contact area? Right. Oh. I know eventually there was those guys that you call them and then they connect you. Operators. So you could press this and then he says, and then you say like, oh, I want to call Igor Kearns. And then they're like, oh, yay. You get to call Igor Kearns. These are, this is his number. So up until mobile phones were created, this was one of the only ways that you could contact someone if you were away from home. So how do you think that this would change your life if that were still the case? I'd die. I probably would be very frustrated. It's not bad. I would live, I think. I'd be really sad, like, where's my phone? I'd probably have to ask everyone for their phone number. Then I'd have to write it down, all down, and then probably like tape it onto my wall every morning so I could remember. Communication-wise, I would not be very upset. In total, I'd be like, oh, what to do, oh, the nightmare. I am bored. I use YouTube almost every single day. Well, yes, every single day. And apps sometimes, but without cell phones and no YouTube, I don't know what I would do. So finally, are you happy that you live in a world that's almost completely without pay phones, or do you think that they are kind of useful? I think it's useful to at least have some around. For like people who can't afford them. Um, Cell phones? No, I do not like this. Because then you're not wasting your money on stupid phones. The phones today are way more expensive. I'm happy that I am in a world and almost no more of those. No, and they're not useful. They're ugly and they're horrible. And how do you get coins? Do you know how many germs is on that? You could get sick. They're kind of useful. But I think I'm very glad that I was born in the time where you have cell phones. If you're really desperate or you're one of those old people who like those old technologies, then go ahead, use it. I'll only use it only for good, only, only when I lost, lose my phone. And then when I find it, I'll never use it ever again. Thanks for watching this episode of Kids React. New shows almost every day. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye. Can we get rid of that phone now? Hey guys, Ethan here from FBE. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Kids React. Let us know what old technology you want the kids to react to next in the oh, in the comments. Hang on one sec. Hello? Oh, I gotta take this. Bye.